gypsies welcome back to my channel so i just wanted to show you guys this gorgeous little boho chic window topper that i just made myself in like under 20 minutes and I used basically a curtain rod, scissors, and sorry ribbon. If you want to see how I did it, stay tuned because I'm going to show you guys. Because this right here is my new favorite thing. And I want these on every single window in my house. I absolutely love them. Yes. Okay, guys, stay tuned. Okay, guys, so I'm going to show you the supplies that I'm going to use. Um, I'm a hot mess today. I'm just doing projects around the house and just being an old boho gypsy today, so overlook me. Um, but anyway, this is the sorry ribbon. I have two separate bundles, and the first thing I have to do is decide which bundle that I want to use. So this, I, I got these both off of Etsy. I think it was two different shops. I think they ran about $8 each. So I have these colors here, which are more of a dark darkish colors which they're still absolutely gorgeous and then I have this bundle here which is more bright and vibrant colors so yeah I just have to decide basically which one I want to I thought that was a spider in there but it wasn't which ones I want to use for my bathroom and I'm just absolutely loving these right here so I think I'm going to go ahead and choose these for my bathroom so, I'm going to just take these and lay them to the side. So, basically, uh, your sari ribbon is tied at the top with a, a piece of the sari ribbon. So, basically, what you're going to do is go all the way down to the end because it's like a loop. And I'm going to cut with my scissors right here. So, that's exactly what I'm going to do. Um, first of all, I just wanted to show you I have scissors and I have this curtain rod which is probably as old as I am <laughs> yeah I probably should have gotten a new curtain rod but it's a per it's in perfectly good shape other than it looks like it may have belonged to who's really old I don't know I don't know Methuselah I don't know but anyway I'm gonna go ahead and cut this but first of all I'm gonna go ahead and put the um, camera down here so you can see what I'm doing let's see here yes right here that way you can see i do have my boho gypsy skirt on today which i absolutely love okay so i'm going to go ahead and cut this my scissors are not the best so bear with me on that but i just basically need to cut right through here so that's what i'm going to do i don't think ah these will work just fine okay and then this is just going to be super easy from here I'll show you a couple, and then we will go um, faster. I'll speed up the video while I'm doing some. So I've cut it in half, so now I have one huge long piece, okay? So basically what I'm going to do is set out my curtain rod here, just like this, and I'm going to pull out, I'm going to just drape this across my lap, I'm going to pull out two pieces of this sorry ribbon at a time, okay? So these two right here. See, and I'm just going to hold the center, pull them out, and here they are. Okay, well, look how gorgeous it is. I mean, it's just gorgeous. And then what you're going to do is you're going to find the center of that. Just put the ends all together like this. You're going to find the center. Okay, then what we're going to do is we're going to loop it underneath this curtain rod, just like this. Okay, then we're going to take it and pull this up through there. And then we're going to cinch it tight. So basically, this is how it's going to look all the way across. Okay? So we're just going to sit here and we're going to do a couple more. And then I'm going to stop the video and restart it so I can speed it up. I know I should be able to do that anyway, but yeah, not that good. Just not that good. Okay, so I'm pulling out two more pieces of the sorry ribbon. Look at this. Okay. And getting it right at the center. See right there's the bottom. Here's the center. Pull it right up through here. And then just kind of pull it up and cinch it tight. Okay. 
And then you can just kind of pull it down and move it wherever you need to. So there's how it's going to look. And then I'll show you what to do when we're all finished here. But first of all, I'm going to start the video and restart it and go faster in doing this. Okay guys, so I've used a whole pack of sorry ribbon and this is basically what we're left with. So, and as you can see, some of the ribbon is longer than the others. So what I'll do is I will take it in here, I will put it up and I will trim across the bottom and make it as long as I want it. And I'll take you with me. So let's go do that. Okay guys, so this being my first time doing this, I have made the mistake of not doing enough of these across. I thought like when I was doing it, I thought that was how wide my um, curtain rod was, but actually it was a lot wider, like, you know, this way to go across. So, and this is way longer than I wanted anyway, so I just wanted basically a balance type thing just to go across like the top here. So what I'm going to do, and I'm not going to film all this, but I'm just going to show you guys what I'm going to do. What I'm going to do is take down, and what I did was took down the first one already just to show you guys, and I'm going to take that one in the middle, I'm going to cut it right in the middle. And what I'm going to do is make a bunch more of these, um, of these, hold on, I think figure out how I'm going to hold this, so I'm going to just like this, only they're going to be shorter. So what I'm going to do is show you, just like this, and I'll have double, oh yeah, it's going to be perfect. So I'll have double the amount, and if you can see right here, this is going to be the length, and then once I trim that off, it's going to be absolutely gorgeous. I'm not going to make you watch me do all of that, so I'm just going to go ahead and pause it until I get it all done. Be right back. Okay, guys, so I've cut it all. Um, I absolutely love it. So basically, you can see, like, looking down through here, that there's a few that are just a little bit longer than the rest. So basically what I'm going to do, I'm not going to cut too much off because I like, you know, I don't want them to be like absolutely perfect because they're not supposed to be absolutely perfect. They're just supposed to be, you know, just cute little boho curtains. And here's a string that is a little crazy. Hold on. Let me get that off. Yeah. Okay. So... If a couple pieces are longer than the rest, I feel like that's okay. I'm just mainly those little strings. You probably can't even see them from your view, but there are a few little strings just from where the the material, I guess, rivals a little bit. But on. guys, this is gorgeous. I want these on every window of my house. And let me just say the um the patterns on this i'm going to show you a closer look of these patterns and they are absolutely gorgeous i absolutely love them so i'm going to go ahead and stop the camera i'm going to turn it around and just get in there and just kind of let you see like some of the little patterns on these um, ribbons first of all i just wanted to show you guys this is my dollar tree um window pane cover up blurry stuff here. I did that today and then I um, did this. So I'm just going to kind of slowly go over through here so you guys can see this gorgeousness. There are so many different variations and I absolutely love it so much. 
look at this like look at this look how gorgeous that is i love that so much wow and this one i mean there's a lot of gorgeous ones but like look at that they are beautiful so there is my new little boho chic curtains that sign's gotta go i mean like it just clashes with my curtains so anyway i love my curtains and if you guys do any like this let me know uh send me a picture on my email or gmail or not email or gmail or instagram or something send me a picture let me see what you guys has turned out like um, just want to say I absolutely love mine. So anyway, if you watch this, guys, thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe and share if you want to. And yeah, have a great day, guys. Bye.